Damasco Construction. Today we're going to give you a quick tutorial on how to cut a razor straight paint line. Uh, what we've done is we're simulating a break in the paint, whether it's going to be in an angle or on an outside angle, ceiling, baseboard, it's going to be the same thing. I prefer to use tan masking tape versus blue. Uh, blue is less sticky, um, but if you've given your paint enough time to dry, we, we did this yesterday, so it's been dry for 24 hours. Uh, we don't have to worry about pulling off that under layer with this tape. So I like this, it's more sticky, uh, you get a straighter line. So basically I'm going to paint our sample, top sample, with no copy and show you what happens once I pull the tape. And there's other products out there like frog tape and I don't know what the other names are. They claim that they will cut a straight line over textured wall, but it's, it's a gimmick for the most part. So when I pull that, you can see if you get in close, a lot of that paint went underneath the tape where you have texture, where you've got voids and high and lows. Uh, now I'm going to show you how we actually do it as painters in the field. You're going to get some painters caulking. Uh, it could be clear or white, it doesn't really matter. You're going to put a thin bead on your brake. If you get excess on there, don't worry about it because you're going to wipe it almost all the way off. Wet sponge, I like to wet my hand first and wipe it tight. And what that does is it fills in the voids so that the paint doesn't get in the voids. And it's important, you don't want to let the caulking dry. You want to paint it wet. If it dries and you rip the tape, it will rip the paint and you'll have to start all over again. Usually we do this kind of with a, in a team system, so you've got one guy ahead of you running tape and caulking, the other guy's painting and pulling the tape as you go around the room. That way nothing dries. You can see the difference. Usually you don't break a paint line right in the middle of a wall, but if you did this on a corner, up at the ceiling or on a bullnose corner bead, it would be laser straight. You still have a little bit of touch up to do, but versus the alternative, it's the only way to go. 